I would like to welcome you to my presentation on 3D perception for your robot. Let me briefly introduce myself. My name is Michael Super, and I'm the CEO and co-founder of Roboception, a Munich-based startup. Roboception's mission is sense, reason, and act. We are going from pixel to axiom and reason perception and providing our customers not only point clouds and depth information, but also task relevant information such as grass points. Our product portfolio is listed on this particular slide here. So to the bottom, you can see the RC Wizard, which is our um, hardware stereo based sensor, which comes with a standard software package. In the middle, you can see our RC Reason software suite. This is uh, the particular product, SLAM, Tech Detect, Item Pick, Box Pick, and Silhouette Match. All our products come with an easy to use web GUI so that you can configure them and use them without being an expert in the field of vision. On the top layer, you can see our customer specific applied AI solution. So whenever one of our products doesn't fulfill the task, we are also developing customer specific applications which can be then integrated in your solution. You can find in some information on that at the end of this presentation. The RC Wizard is a 3D stereo based depth sensor. It comes in two baselines, 65 millimeters and 160 millimeters. Um, on top of the uh, stereo data, it also provides the ego motion, that means the pose of the sensor with respect to its environment. The RC Wizard has onboard processing capabilities and intuitive and uh, easy to use plug and play interfaces. In case of scenes with little or low, no visual texture, the RC Wizard can be combined with a random dot projector. This random dot projector does not need to be calibrated to the sensor, it is only timely synchronized so that you can access data with and without the pattern. The sensor provides the following information. To the left, you can see the colored uh, camera image. Um, next to it, you can see the depth image. Uh, the red are the pixels are the closer they are to the camera. So that provides you the range information of the system. In addition to the depth, we are also providing confidence images. These images tell you basically how, how reliable the measurement was and how much trust the system has in its measurement itself. This is particularly important for applied AI and other information that re require decision making based on the depth information. To the right, you can see the um, 3D reconstruction. This is not done on board of the sensor, but can easily be used uh, with our tools that uh, you can find in the GitHub. Let me introduce the RC Reason Tech Detect module to you. So with this module running on board of RC Wizard, we can easily detect um, QR codes and April tags. This means we are not only uh, able to uh, determine the exact pose, but also able to detect objects and use them for in, in other applications. The next module I'd like to introduce to you is the R3 is an item pick. Item pick is made for logistics. Basically, it works best when you don't have any a priori information on the items you want to pick um, in, to, in combination with a suction cup. So basically, the module provides you grass points um, and detects the bin so that you can easily um, commission objects without knowing what they actually are. This module runs on board of the RC Wizard and has a very intuitive web GUI for configuration. And also, as usual, we are providing a tryout uh, button so that you can directly see on the scenes what kind of grass points are provided by the system. Another module is BotsPick. This is a module that is made for detecting rectangular shaped objects. And you can use it for palletizing or depalletizing tasks, as you can see here in the video. Here we are using an, an, an EVA 
um, and a suction pump together with RC wizard, which is mounted above the pallet to place the object in the right orientation on this conveyor. As opposed to the item pick module, we are providing here also the orientation of the objects so that exact placement is possible. Another module is the RC reason silhouette match. Um, this module runs on board of the wizard, uh, RC wizard as well, and uh, it is made for detecting comparatively flat objects on planar surfaces and placing them accurately in a machine or on a um, target position. As opposed to the previous uh, task here, we need a CAD model of the object, generate a template which is then recognized by the model. Or optimally, you would also uh, like to use the random depth projector with this particular software. The SLAM module uh, is made for mobile robots. Usually when you're navigating through a scene, the visual odometry that is a part of the base package of the RC wizard provides you uh, a drift that is accumulated over time. The SLAM module helps you to localize exactly and reduce the drift because it uses features that have been seen before to reduce uh, the particular drift in the navigation. As opposed to the classical laser-based SLAM, we here use the full 3D information of the environment, which in addition can also be used for collision detection, not only in one plane, but in the full 3D space uh, in front of the robot. A new product which was launched a couple of weeks ago is the 3DR vision and handling set. For this particular set, we combine item pick or box pick together with a collision detection module and the Schmalz cobalt pump. So here, uh, as opposed to the regular item pick and box pick, you can have, get collision free grasps with a bin um, as for um, logistics applications. You can, it comes with a UR cap where you can easily also generate your application um, for these particular objects and tasks. All our products and modules come with an intuitive web GUI, which you can see an example of here. The web GUI can be used for configuration, especially gaining exposure, visual control. You can see the images, the depth images, you can control the projector, and for each of the application modules, you also have the possibility to configure load carrier, region of interest, and also uh, have an easy to use tryout button so that you can directly see what kind of parameters are used and how the result may look like. The sensor, it comes, comes uh, intrinsically calibrated already. So for your application, you only need to add the external hand eye calibration. RC Wizard itself runs a self calibration. So a recalibration of the sensor itself is not required uh, over time. Another example is the Swiss Lock item pick system. Here, um, Swiss Lock provides you with a full cell which integrates our self learning uh, vision pipeline. It's made for logistics, so a priori we don't have any information on the picked items. And the system itself, by picking the item, learns the geometry and improves grasping and picking performance over time. This system is again optimally suited for logistics and is usually combined with the auto store systems of Swiss Lock. Another example of a customer solution is the Pick Center Revolution by TGW. Here we use ERC with 160 and combine it with an intelligent software for um, picking unknown items from up to four bins and commissioning them into an output bin. The whole system um, contains a portal robot and is able to uh, perform 1,000 picks per, per hour. More examples of our uh, customers you can find on this slide. To the lower right, again, an example for the web GUI, and I'd like to step through you through the different applications. To the left, you can see the Werk 5 application in architecture and using robots in these, this domain. 
Then you can see uh, an example with uh, MBTech or the Hulk and Vision library. We are fully compliant to that. You can easily create your own application with Halcon based on the uh, RC wizard data. The SwissLock system I already introduced. Um, the same applies to the GDW system to the right. Examples uh, which we created together with Schung, you can see in the, uh, in the middle. Here the task is to perform machine tending for these pistons with a um, uh, Schung uh, gripper on a KUKA robot. With our partner RG Technologies, um, we developed a system which you can automatically detect quality zones so that the leather that you're putting below the camera can be cut and part partitioned optimally based on the quality and the space that is available for the cutting. In addition to that, you can find a small mobile robot application here from our partner um, University of Applied Sciences Upper Austria. They used the robot in, in a challenge for navigation um, and the SLAM module on top of that. Other partners such as Steel, Bosch, and German Aerospace Center and KUKA we work, very, work with very closely and generate similar applications. This ends my presentation and I'd like to welcome you to our live demo from our lab, which you can find on the expo button and by clicking on it. And I'm looking forward to seeing many of you there asking us questions and getting an insight in our uh, applications and uh, software. Thank you very much for your attention. I'm looking forward to your questions and don't forget to visit our lab demo.